Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Martin Sloan. I'm thrilled to be sharing the next post in my regular video series here on my website. In each episode, I plan to tackle a question or challenge that I hear about regularly as a veterinarian with the pets that I see every day. Today's topic is about laser surgery and whether or not it is a viable option, a viable option for your pet. By the end of this video, I promise that you will have some useful information about the benefits that laser surgery can provide. But before we get started, I just want to, to remind you to check out our website, connect with us on Twitter and Facebook and LinkedIn, and subscribe to our newsletter so that you will have immediate access to insider tips and tricks. I want to start by explaining what a laser actually is. A laser beam is an intense beam of light that can cut, seal or vaporize tissue. It's a fairly new tool that offers safe and comfortable treatment for your furry friends and provides many benefits and uses. There are three reasons to consider laser surgery. It ensures a speedier recovery. As it cuts the tissue, the laser seals the nerve endings. This makes the recovery more comfortable for your pet. It causes less bleeding. The laser also seals off the small blood vessels and this cuts down on the length of the surgery, which means less time under anesthetic for your pet. It reduces swelling. A laser does not crush, tear or bruise the tissue because a beam of light is the only thing touching your pet. Let me demonstrate. This is pretending this is a patient. We are gonna be using the laser beam to engrave an area just to demonstrate that the only thing touching the patient is the laser beam. During an actual surgery, we would normally have a smoke evacuator removing the smoke fumes that are created during the laser process, just because it's not healthy for us to in inhale those fumes. Laser surgery offers several benefits during the recovery time as well. Because of the sealing capabilities of the laser, there are fewer bacteria present at the wound. Also, unhealthy tissues are removed with precision, reducing the risk that the surrounding healthy tissue will be damaged. Overall recovery time is decreased because these secondary setbacks are less likely to occur. Laser surgery can be used in a variety of different situations. Spaying and neutering, dental surgery, declaw procedures in cats, and let me tell you, the difference with the recovery with a declaw surgery in cats with laser is actually quite profound. Dermatological problems, removal of cysts, tumors, and warts. Pretty much most soft, soft tissue surgery can be performed with laser surgery. Laser procedures are commonly used for dogs, cats, horses, and many other farm and companion animals. Ask your vet if your pet might benefit from laser surgery. They will know if it, it is an appropriate consideration and will explore your, your options more thoroughly. Many times laser surgery is perceived to be more costly, and while it may be, it can surprisingly also decrease cost by way of shorter surgical times, less complicated and faster recoveries, as well as allowing us in some cases to locally freeze an area, for example, a skin growth and removing it with only a sedative rather than perform a full general anesthetic. At the Center Street Animal Hospital, we have been using laser surgery on all our soft tissue surgeries since 2004. And within six months of the change, we were so pleased with the improved recoveries that we discontinued offering any routine or soft tissue surgeries unless they were performed with the laser scalpel this high-tech medical option became standard surgical procedure for us. So I hope I've inspired you with this post and that you feel empowered to support your pet's health and welfare with this important information. I would be happy to answer any of your questions, so feel free to share them in the section below. Also, we would love to have you come by our clinic and we can chat in person about how to optimize your pet's health. Spend some time on our website, sign up for our newsletter, and send us an email. We would love to connect with you in person. Thanks again. I'm Dr. Martin Sloan. Until next time, have a wonderful day.